Good evening, everybody. My name's John, and I'm the MMA adjudicator for this season. I'm so sorry I can't be with you tonight, but I'm at the Oldham Coliseum performing in Priscilla, Queen of the Desert, for Congress players. So I'm sorry I can't be there, but I'm sure you're having a great evening. Long may it continue in the new venue. Can I first of all say a big thank you to Jill and the MMA committee for inviting me to be the adjudicator this year. <laughs> It's been a very enjoyable experience being out there for the last 10 months, watching all the talent that's around in this area. We're so lucky to have the talent we have and long may it continue. Well done, everybody. Also, I'd like to thank all the societies I've been to see and the warm welcome at every single venue. Thank you very much. So being an adjudicator isn't a job I've taken lightly this year. Those of you who know me will know that, well, I'm not, scared of giving an opinion but that is exactly what it is it is an opinion and it's my opinion and I can't apologize for having that opinion and I don't want to make any excuses for having that opinion likewise I wouldn't expect anybody to apologize to me for having their opinion it is what it is and what it should be this evening is a celebration of us all being on stage doing something that we love and are very passionate about so please don't feel negative if I haven't given you a nomination or an award. I've had to make a job happen, and I have done that to the best of my abilities. It's not been easy. Friends that I've seen, it's been hard to, to consider how do I give them an award or not give them an award? What will people think? I've had to block all that out of my head and think, this is what I'm going to do, and I've done it in that way. So I've done it. And hopefully, none of you will fall out with me for doing it. Let's just celebrate the evening. Amateur theatre is something that we should all celebrate. It's something that we're all involved in to various degrees. You know, there'll always be somebody who's a better singer, a better dancer, a better actor. But we don't do this as a job. We do this as a hobby. And we've all got to enjoy that hobby. As a director, I know that different venues come up with their own problems. And as amateurs, we only have a certain amount of time to resolve those problems. Professional ha professionals have weeks of weeks of time to prepare. They have sets made specifically for theatre spaces. We don't have that luxury. And how we get over the problems that we have and come up with the solutions, I think is commendable to every single society that's going. You know, however, bad some people might think a society is, they're still putting on a show and that's got to be commended. Um, and long may amateur theatre continue, basically. So, to my adjudicator's award. Putting on a show has many different aspects, from hiring rehearsal venues, making the tea at rehearsals, auditioning processes, the whole aspect from start to finish, there are so many different things that go on to make on a show, to put on a show, should I say. And as an adjudicator, all I get to see is the end result. Now, as a director and being involved in shows for years, I do understand the whole process from start to finish. And I don't know every single story behind every single show, unfortunately. All I can do is judge on what I see on stage. But from that, I, I believe what happens on stage all comes down to what's happened throughout the process. Being a performer myself, I understand that having a great team, backup team behind me, makes my job on stage so much easier and so much more enjoyable knowing that I've got that teamwork behind me. Um, there was many shows that displayed this on and off stage. I felt that there was a great team ethic lots of energy being shown on stage because you were all working together as a team. There is one show that I saw on a particular night and I felt what I saw that evening just demonstrated all the aspects that I love about any show. The teamwork was there. You could not deny that every single person on the stage was committed to that show and putting on the best that they could. No matter how good or bad they were, and like I said, there are various people who are better dancers, better singers. But as a whole, that team of people just showed what it's all about performing. And they took me to a different time and place. And I 
I, all I can do is congratulate them for that. But I can also congratulate the people behind the scenes for making their job that much easier to actually be able to do what they did on that night. So my award doesn't go to an individual, it goes to a society for, for really doing something that I feel very passionate about, and that is entertaining people. So my award goes to NK Arts for their production of Made in Dagenham. Congratulations. Have a wonderful evening. Thank you very much indeed. Good night. Love you all.